Hey guys, if you guys need your dominations, 12 and 0s, evos, anything that has to do with online or offline grinding, be sure to hit up Rose NBA on Twitter. The link to his Twitter will be in the description down below. 100% legit and 100% reliable, so be sure to go hit him up now. What's up guys, today I'm actually going to be opening up a bunch of different badge packs here and the reason why I'm actually doing a little bit of my old intro is because I'm actually like, I don't know, it's just weird to record right now, that's all I'm going to say, but like I said, I'm actually going to be opening up a bunch of these different badge packs here, um, we are going to be getting hopefully multiple Hall of Fame badges in this video. Um, we did actually get this Diamond Jordan shoe plus the Hall of Fame badge from the challenge, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about. When you go to these challenges right here, you do have the signature challenge and it does actually give you um, a Hall of Fame badge and a shoe for free. So that is basically going to be the headline of this video. But also we have a bunch of different prize packs that have come from the agenda stuff like and stuff like that. So you guys can see scrolling back to the beginning here. Um, you do have the glass cleaner one, which is the first one. You have the shot creator one, the post score, the lockdown, the rim protector, all these different badges and stuff like that. Um, you actually can get Hall of Fame badges. Now, I've done this video every single season, and I think in every single one, I've pulled at least one additional Hall of Fame badge. So that would be pretty cool if we can keep that streak alive. If you guys do enjoy this video, do me a favor and hit that like button. If you guys are new to the channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button. But before we get into this, I need you guys to do me a favor. Pause this video and comment down below what Hall of Fame badge you guys think I get. And uh, yeah, let's get right into it. So some of the other stuff though that we do have are these like random badge packs that I've gotten from basically just playing through triple threat and I figured why not it is a badge video so I just stopped opening them after a certain point just to see if we do get any you know like deep threes or blinders or anything like that. So starting out with bailout not too bad uh, bailout actually could potentially become useful at some point the reason why I say that is because point guards for some reason haven't been getting bailout so it's just one of those badges that you could potentially end up using on your players and stuff like that bailout is kind of nice as well you know because sometimes the game just doesn't let you pump fake and when i say sometimes i i mean all the time it doesn't let you pump fake so having a badge is going to help you know prevent you know turning the ball over and stuff like that and it's actually going to help so catch and shoot i will actually take that that is a badge that i really do like silver corner specialist is something that i really was hoping to see out of some of these but it's all good these aren't going to be the last badge packs we get anyway because there's still a bunch we are going to be getting through grinding triple threat offline uh but yeah so we have the rest of these so let's just go ahead and open them up in order i'm obviously going to save the hall of fame badge pack for last so first one up here and we get a free hall of fame badge in our very first one we get hall of fame rebound chaser this is what i'm saying you there is a good chance to get additional hall of fame badges in these packs and the very first one we actually land an additional hall of fame badge that is actually a fat w if you ask me i mean i'll take it like a hall of fame badge is a hall of fame badge you know what i'm saying so it's really like i don't even care whether like i you know get them or not it's just i don't mean i don't care what i get a hall of fame badge is a hall of fame badge so I'm going to take them regardless, um, and I'm going to be kind of talking about something here at the end of this video that does involve these badges, so be sure to stay tuned for that. Um, you know, I'm going to just throw all these contracts on Kawhi. I don't think I'm ever even going to need a diamond contract for Kawhi, because every time I get additional contracts from these packs and stuff like that, I always throw them on Kawhi, so... You know, it doesn't really matter. That lock badge is, uh, or that lock badge pack was one that I was really hoping to see a Hall of Fame badge from. Just because, like, if I could have pulled clamps or something like that, that would have been really cool. But you know what? I'm already, I'm already chilling. Pulling one additional Hall of Fame badge keeps the streak alive. That is all that matters. We do get Rim Protector right there. Um, and Rebound Chaser really isn't all that bad either. Because if I had a guy that, you know, could maybe play the four, but one of the weak points was you know playing the uh, or you know playing on the glass and stuff like that that's gonna actually help out a lot um now actually really quick though i'm gonna open up this one and then i'm gonna stop for a second to kind of talk about something so playmaking badge we get another one and we get hall of fame dimer that is a fat w like that is what i'm saying these badge packs are so good so we do actually have this slasher pack and the sharp pack. The sharp badge is actually from the agenda stuff, but this slasher pack, if you guys are on next gen, I actually want to talk about this really quick. This PS5 challenge is really easy to do. It's a five minute quarter game, which does suck, but 10 dunks in the win. It does give you the slasher badge pack. Um, so I just kind of wanted to clear that up just in case people were kind of confused where this one came from. But again, same thing. It could potentially give you a free hall of fame badge. So make sure you guys go ahead and do this. We actually get a diamond and we get a diamond shoe from it. So we actually end up getting a free, like this is what I'm saying. These badge packs are so underrated. Make sure you guys grind for these because they are really good. Now this is the most important one here. Hopefully we pull a hall of fame badge out of this one. 
Can we clutch up and we get three golds and we get corner specialist. I will take that. That is what I need for Kawhi. So it is what it is there. Final badge pack though. This is going to be pretty cool here because this is going to be a guaranteed diamond shoe and a guaranteed hall of fame badge. The diamond shoe we're going to be getting, ah, it's not really the best. I was just kind of hoping for a uh, three point shoe. Anytime I get a diamond shoe, all I really want to see on it is three pointer. I don't really care about anything else, but it is what it is. So this is the moment of truth here. The guaranteed hall of fame badge ideally like i said corner specialist would be cool outside of the top three you know being range dime or uh, range clamps and like inner or intimidator interceptor would be cool hot zone hunter would be cool show me the money though give me hall of fame corner specialist so we're gonna open this in three two one is it good I is it good are y'all are y'all laughing at me or are y'all like rooting for me? I I can't tell. I really can't tell right now. You know what? I don't know why I I I'm gonna just call this right now that it's Hall of Fame clutch shooter. That's my prediction. Hall of Fame clutch shooter. I think that's what it is. So let's take a minute, take a second. Yeah, I mean, Fade Ace isn't really like terrible, but ah i don't know man but you know what look in one video three hall of fame badges when we were only guaranteed one hall of fame dimer was the biggest w of them all if i'm being completely honest like literally getting hall of fame dimer is clutch as all hell so i will gladly take that rebound chaser again this is a badge like like, like i was saying i could even put that on a guy like Kawhi. i mean i'm not going to just because like i would rather put it on a big that doesn't have it yet um, but I mean, Hall of Fame Fade Ace, we could actually put that on a guy like Kawhi. Um, maybe even put it on Clay. I mean, it's literally says improves the ability to shoot post fades, but I mean, it kind of works like, you know, if you kind of cheese the fades, you, like, you guys know what I'm saying. Um, so I don't know. We might have to throw that on a guy like Kawhi. Maybe we even wait, throw it on a guy like Jordan when we do get the Dark Matter one potentially. Um, but either way, though, I mean, like I said, I will take it. It's free Hall of Fame badges. At the end of the day, that is all that matters. We do get a couple of good additional ones, like other badges and stuff like that, like Catch and Shoot. We got Corner Specialist. Um, I actually, where did did like my corner specialist just disappear like i i pulled one i specifically remember pulling it or am i am i just blind i feel like you guys are like screaming at me right now being like it's in front of you and i'm like oh there it is okay um okay so we do need to still get the silver one i believe to put on Kawhi. uh and then once we do that he will finally have corner specialist because that is that is one of the things that i have legitimately like just haven't done yet and i really need to put on that Kawhi. so i'm gonna go ahead and do that but either way thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys did enjoy like i said i wanted to just make this video because they're they are fun to do um so yeah you know be sure to uh stay tuned for that um give you guys a quick little update on the xp situation everything is completed literally everything so we're chilling just kind of waiting for more xp to drop today is sunday tomorrow being monday i already have two videos coming to you guys for tomorrow uh, both videos that are going to be dropping are, what even are they? I like legitimately forgot. That's not good, man. Oh, wait, yo, that's, that's, that's really not good. Okay. never mind. This video is actually going to be going out tomorrow. So I thought I was going to post this today. I've actually had today's video done and I'm just a slacker and forgot to post it. So that's on me. But either way, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope you guys do enjoy subscribe to the channel. If you guys are new and uh, yeah, peace.